Hey guys, what up, I hope here. Welcome back to the channel. Now, yesterday Apple released iOS 15.5, and if you haven't updated to the software as of yet, in this video, I wanted to share with you guys some important details as into why you should definitely consider updating your iPhone to the latest iOS 15.5. Now, as always, if you would like to stay up to date with the latest iOS news and Apple software updates, don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on those notifications so that you don't miss another episode. Now, in regards to features this is the exact same software we talked about when i covered ios 15.5 rc is the exact same build number the same features apply however there's important details that you need to know in regards to this software that will improve your user experience and protect you as a user and this is why i'm making this video for you guys now we know that ios 15.5 has added some new features to the apple cash right here so if we go to the apple cash we can now send and request money we knew about that apple has also fixed automations within the shortcuts application so if you left your home and arrive and those notifications weren't working this software will address that issue there's also new features within the podcast application so the podcast application will no longer store all your podcasts it would actually delete the old ones and therefore not taking all the storage from your iphone this was a bug and now slash new feature that's been addressed with the actual podcast application on your iphone 15.5 is available for ios but apple also updated the ipads with ipad os 15.5 the mac was also updated with 12.4 the watch was also updated with 8.6 and the apple tv tvos 15.5 was released as well so let's take a look here at apple's about security content of ios 15.5 and ipad os 15.5 did you know that ios 15.5 contains 30 or plus security patches for your iphone and ipads and let me say that again over 30 security patches this has got to be the biggest security patch for ios in a very very long time all these cves that you see here one two and then another and then another and then another it just continues to go on the list here of security patches this alone is the main reason i believe you guys should definitely consider updating to ios 15.5 i mean take a look at this list of security patches you want to keep your iphone up to date with the latest security patches your ipads as well i mean look at this list guys i don't think i remember seeing such a big list of security patches as of right now with iOS 15.5 and iPadOS 15.5. Not to mention that Apple has also expanded on communication safety. Now communication safety is a feature that allows you to enable it, right? If you have children under the settings here, if we go into settings right here, and then you go into the screen time options. If you have screen time enabled for one of your children here, you can go into communication safety. And of course, this will prompt the child if they received any nude photos or any inappropriate material through the messages of iPhone this will prompt them and guide them through how to properly take steps in order to address the situation so communication safety has been expanded aside from being available in the US Apple has now added additional countries Australia you're in the list now Canada you're also on the list New Zealand is also on the list and the United Kingdom is also now available for you as well so a lot of security patches expanding on communication safety this alone aside from some of the latest new features is enough for you to definitely definitely consider updating to ios 15.5 i thought this information was rather important and i wanted to update you guys with this information i hope you found it helpful have a great day guys and i'll see you on the next one peace